Hi everyone! Hi everybody! Hi! We're super excited today because we are here with one of my most favorite people in the world, Kathy, Atypical 60, um, who looks absolutely beautiful. Well, thanks to you, I'm wearing Avalon, and I have to tell you guys, this is great summer hair. If you have bio hair, if you don't have bio hair, go out and get Avalon because she's going to make your summer. She can make anything look good. Okay, let's just be honest, you can make anything look good. But we are here today to talk about our new collection that is launching today. Statement 2019. And I have the awesome honor and privilege of having Kathy here to help showcase these beauties. So we've got four styles that are coming out in this new collection. And I think you're gonna love all of the styles. Uh, we've got Ryan over here, and she is an asymmetrical pixie. Um, we've got Sutton, which is a beautiful blunt cut lob. We've got Ellis over here, again, blunt cut and a little bit shorter of a bob. And the beautiful Preston, another modern bob with gorgeous waves throughout. So we're going to talk a little bit about these styles. So Kathy, tell me, what do, you, what do you think? I think they're all great. They all have their separate personalities. But the thing that's great about them, even the short ones, and you know that I'm not much of a pixie person, but I have to say, Ryan and Preston are absolutely amazing because they're on trend. They don't look austere. There's a looseness and a casualness about them that I think will work for every woman of every age. And what I also like about Ryan and Preston is that they are definitely winter sport friendly. So that. if you're out there skiing, if you're snowboarding, if you're ice skating, you can go outside till your heart's content and wear the heaviest clothes possible and nothing is going to get matted. These wigs are going to be perfect. From sports to dinner, it's a winner all the way. Love it. So. Let's take a closer look at some of these styles. So taking a look at Ryan, Ryan is a lace front with a lace part. So in addition to our natural collection, if you take a look at this beautiful inside, we've got that gorgeous lace front and that nice deep lace part here for the most natural look that you could ever have with a beautiful part. Now, Kathy, actually, before we did this, tried on Ryan, and I do have to say, I know that Kathy doesn't normally wear pixies, but you looked fabulous. Well, let's try it on. You wanna try this one I'll on? try it on. Okay, let's take a look at it. Let me take my hair off. All right, and, and put, put another hair on. put some more hair on. All right, let's do this. Here we go. <laughs> Look at this girl. Oh my God, this color too. This is Ryan and Chrome R2MB. Be honest, Kathy, because I know that you don't normally like pixies and it's not your jam, but I gotta say. I don't know, I, you know what? I'm not a pixie person, but this takes a pixie to another level. Let me take a look at that. This is a fun pixie. This is a fixie, a fun pixie. <laughs> it's a fixie! It's a fixie. <laughs> It's a, it's a pixie. So we love this. Look, how cute is that? And I, I really do have to be honest, I wasn't sure about a shorter style on you because I've never seen shorter styles on you. And you wear the bob, you wear long, ridiculously gorgeously, this, but this one? This is fun. I love that with the color of your dress. It's and you know, you know what else is really great about this? Um, I know that there are a lot of women who during the holidays and a, any time of year like to host. Mm -hmm parties at home or whatever, this is a great wig for that because you're not going to get anything messed up. Nothing is going to, even when you're cooking, I know that you're not supposed to cook with synthetic wigs, but you get somebody to open the oven for you. And this is going to go from kitchen to dining room perfectly. I love that. And Anya. people are going to be jealous. I love that color. Have you ever tried the Chrome or T1B? Yeah, I have a Jameson. Oh, yes, yes, and I Jameson. Loved, I love that I love it. color. I love the that color. RT1B. I think it's pretty amazing how you're able to go from Chrome to Caramel Kiss to 1226 to a base color of brown. It is amazing. But you know, I think a lot of it is attitude. I think if you mm -hmm. are comfortable mm -hmm. in any hair that you have and you go out and you own it, that's 
that's it. that's the deal exactly you have to own it it's like going out in a pair of high heels it's like mm -hmm. going out in that dress that you love that you know is going to look really great you own that I love so it. you have to get and this is this is something that newbies for wigs need to realize it's not about the other people it's about you this is about how you feel this is about how you look and if you're confident in a wig People aren't even going to realize that you're wearing a wig. They're going to think that it's your regular bio hair. But this is adorable. I love it. I mean, you. look at the look at the fit of this. I love it. I mean, there's. I love how this it is, hugs this right here. It that definitely nape. does. It hugs the nape. There is nothing that says this is wiggy. This is very very natural looking. I love it. I'm surprised. I am surprised. I absolutely love this pixie on you. This is it looks adorable. Great. It's a different look for you, Kathy, and I love the look. It's edgy, it's cool, it's different, and I love it on you. And you know, the thing is, there are a lot of women who do, and I have friends who love short hair. Like their bio hair is short, everything is short. And I think for the woman who really prefers a shorter wig, this is great because it could be out of the box for somebody who maybe wears a more conservative or austere mm -hmm. looking wig. Mm -hmm. This is fun. This is definitely fun. This is outside the box for a lot of people and sometimes you need to go out and try exactly. that box. And it's great. And you can make anything fun though, Kathy. And you can so. texturize this also with the spray. Yeah, absolutely. You can so get some texture in there, get, get it going. Get some texture, you can make it messy, you can just put it, oh, oh yeah. Oh, that, oh yeah. Oh, oh I love that. We can even put it behind the ear. Oh, um, when it's showing off those cute Show earrings. off your earrings. I love it. I just, I can't get over the color. I love you in this color. This really is do. very versatile, I, 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 I really swear, like even for a, shorter wig this is definitely versatile because I love it this you've got this length so you can put it behind your yeah, ear you for a different look rolls. you can take a little headband <gasps> uh, whatever I think the possibilities are endless and I, I think it. this is definitely a great wig it's a summer wig for winter sport all right I love it so now we're gonna move on to Sutton okay Sutton is a gorgeous blunt cut lob the cap construction is a monofilament top with a lace front. So you get the wonderful ability to style it whatever way you want. Middle center part, left part, right part, whatever you want to do. Also pulling it back off of your face so that you have that natural hairline. Beautiful. And I know Caramel Kiss is your color. Caramel Kiss. There you go. I wore this to work yesterday and people were going crazy. Take a look at that. Oh, I love it. But then again, as we said, I mean, it's pretty amazing how Kathy, I mean, you can really wear, you know, this style. You rocked a pixie in a completely different color and looked amazing. And then you put on Sutton, you know, totally different style, totally different color. And well, you look fantastic. It's, it's also, a different feel. It's a different vibe. Yeah. This is more of a fun, mm -hmm. loosey goosey. Hey, I'm gonna go skiing. I'm having a few drinks. This is fun. This is more of a chic style. Mm -hmm. If you want to take a trip to Paris and you're in the 16th arrondissement <laughs> and you're walking down the street, this is what you're gonna wear. Cause Sutton is just a very, very chic wig. There's nothing about her that says, whoa, I'm different, I'm out there. Mm -hmm. She's very subtle. Which I love. And she's very, very on point as a lob. I mean, she's, she's great. If you love straight hair, this is wonderful. But the thing that's great about mm -hmm. Sutton is that even though it's straight, there's some density here, mm -hmm. so you have that look of fullness, which I think every woman wants to have. And you can also change the part. I happen to like the part a little bit off-center, mm -hmm. because I'm kind of an off-center person. We know but, that. And we love it. But you can part her in the middle, you can wear her pulled back. I just love her because she's understated. And mm -hmm. I think every once in a while, if you've got um, a professional business meeting, if you are going to an event where it is a little bit more, um, not necessarily laid back, but if it's more professional, 
this is something that just evokes I'm a professional or I am here to be serious but I still want to look pretty yeah. so this is perfect this is a beautiful 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 blob and I seriously recommend this for any woman who is serious about her wig I have to say Kathy I love what you said about the fact that you love that it's subtle you know statement 2019 is you know about making your statement but not in that in your face sort of way you know and like you said Kathy you own it you wear it and you own that style whether it's you know Ryan whatever way you're going to own Ryan do it whatever way you're going to own Sutton do it but it's subtle and I love it I love that you said that there's nothing there's nothing ba ba boom about her but when you put her on and you make it your own, and whatever changes, way you want. Like, it kind of changes your personality, mm -hmm. too. It's almost like you can be role-playing. It's like, today I have my lob on, so I won't be as wild and crazy as when I have wild and crazy hair. Or if you want to make it wild and crazy, That's you can kind of scrunch it up, yeah. you can texturize it, yeah. or make it fuller yeah, with get that texturizing spray. Messy look in there. Like, there's nothing that you can't do, and you can even pull her back. Which so great. I think a lob of this length is an incredibly versatile wig because it gives you a lot of options. It's just not wearing her straight, although I love the brush. I, I love that I love this. I love the sleekness. It's sleek. It's sleek. It, and you know what? Even if you want to do a little wild, crazy. I love that a, too. A little messy. I love you it. Can. It looks it, great either way. But I agree with you. I love the sleek, you know, blunt cut. Bob, especially those ends that are real mm -hmm. blunt. I but love you know, that. she's blunt without being um, severe. Yes. Mm -hmm. There's a certain softness. Mm -hmm. Is it because was this razored? Perhaps, maybe. I don't know. I don't think they. But I don't there think is. They, it was razored. Okay, there is a softness here mm -hmm. that a lot of like. Sometimes you'll have a blunt cut that's straight across, but this is just really beautiful. This is a great wig, and this is that wig that. After other women see other women in it, they'll say, gee, you know, I saw that, and I wasn't sure. But then after I saw so-and-so wearing mm -hmm. it, I wanted to get it. Mm -hmm. And that's, this is one of those word-of-mouth wigs where, oh, this is great. Right, because you look at it, and it doesn't look like anything, you know, it's not, like you said, it's not flashy. But when you put it on, that's when you see that's what it. she can become. That's it. You're or wearing what the you wig. you can make her become. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Looking at this next one, so kind of in the same vein of the whole, you know, blunt cut bobs, this is shorter, a beautiful blunt cut bob. This is Ellis. She has, again, a nice lace front, and this is also a nice lace part. And this is in our very popular color, which I love, Silver Sun, rooted. Yeah, Silver Sun is a great, great shade. What do you think about Silver Sun? I love it. I, I'm telling you, I really love it. Now, for me, the only shades that, I'm not going to say don't look good, but the only shades that I have to be wary of are the reds. Mm -hmm. Because the reds with my coloring mm -hmm. have a tendency to look a little off. So I have to make sure that I'm wearing clothing that will offset that. So I do remember on your very first visit to us two years ago, that awesome day... You did wear an orchid in a red color and looked. And that ended up looking Julia nice. Roberts. Looking great. Like all that. Julia Roberts right there. Oh my God. Oh my God. I now love it. I have never tried this on before and oh my God. I love it on I you. Love I this. love it on you. I, I oh. do have to say that I think that this blunt cut bob is um, a little bit more severe. Okay? It's a little bit more severe in the actual, you know, kind of ends of it. What do you think, Kathy? Is it too it's severe? It's more severe. No, it's not too severe because there's, look at, look at the way it moves. Okay. Oh, I love it. See, it moves, it moves beautifully. And look at the way it, look at the way it sets. I love after it. After you move around. Because no, this, this really was created to be that razored edge, blunt, severe cut. And uh, I was a little bit worried because when you said you like the softness of this, I was like, oh, you know, we're moving on to Ellis, and that's it's fairly blunt. No, this is great. Are you kidding? I, I love this. And what I like about Ellis it's is great. that, you know, 
she is a little bit more lower density. There, it's not this big volume, but you can make her more volume, like give her more volume if you want, you know, by kind of scrunching her up. But just out of the box, it's a little bit this more. Is, and that's true. All of these are out of the box. This is crazy good. But you color. said this is low density, but it doesn't feel like it's low mm -hmm. density. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. It doesn't feel like, and trust me, I love big hair. I <laughs> love this. I truly love this. This is great. I really like her on oh YouTube. Oh, my God. Because I, and I'm, I'm surprised also because it is. It is a little bit more slicked down, mm -hmm. you know, definitely. But I love yeah, the but way she it looks on look, you. It doesn't look little. You know, it's interesting. Because what do you think about her it, if you compare it to Jameson, your love? They're two different, you know what? They're two different girls. Jameson is that classic, classic, classic Bob. You're not going to get any more classic than Jameson. I think with, what, what okay. So Ellis. Ellis. Okay. <laughs> Ellis Island. Ellis <laughs> Island. I think with Ellis, it's more of a, mm -hmm. more like, almost like a Dutch boy mm -hmm. edge. Mm -hmm. But there are a lot of women who love that look. I love Ch Jameson, you know. Everybody know. in the world knows Jameson is my number That's one favorite wig. There is no other wig to compare to Jameson. But I love this. I love this too. It's definitely it's different. You're right. It's different. It's a bob, but it's it's not the soft bob of, of Jameson. It's a little bit edgier. Has a little bit a little bit a little bit you of know attitude. What? This is a red lipstick wig. <gasps> this is a red oh. lipstick wig. This is the wig that you wear red lipstick with. With that color mm -hmm. and red lipstick. No other just like a little Some mascara. Heels. Ooh. heels like this. Simple. Simple red lip. Because the red lip mm -hmm. and the and the, and the angle, exactly. the severity of this, make this oh, I didn't totally think about that. crazy. Oh, that, that's the I money. I need to see that. I mm -hmm. need to see. That. I need to see this wig with red lipstick. This color. You're absolutely right. This with red lipstick is oh. gonna be. That's dangerous. dangerous. Yes, it is dangerous. dangerous. It's gonna stop traffic. It, it's gonna stop traffic. <laughs> I love it. You look fabulous. I now, love okay, it. wait, we're, we're moving on to a red. Oh, I have to take this off. Oh, 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 oh no. Oh, no. We're moving on to a red. I'm very interested to see this. So this is Preston, and I know you said you're a little bit, you know, you got to be careful with the reds. Mm -hmm. This is, again, just like Sutton, it's monotop, and you've got that nice lace front. So, again, the ability to part it any way you want, versatility, and it has these beautiful soft waves. So let's see. You want to try it on? I do. Okay. I do. Okay. Even though it's red. Let's see. I don't care. Okay. Ooh. Let's see. <gasps> Ear tabs. Oh my God. So cute. This is really a uh, uh, This is, this Preston is the money crazy pixie. This is great. You know, it's so funny because I, I, I feel like Preston Look is at a this. little bit more of the... Out of Look all of them, texture in the back. Let's look at the back. I agree. You know, I wasn't sure because I feel like Preston's a little bit like these have that sort of edgy. There's this blunt. This one's an asymmetrical pixie, and so I felt that Preston was a little bit maybe not as much part of the family. But I oh, think no, you're absolutely there. right. She's there, and I think the great thing about Preston is you might have the woman who wears wigs who wants like an edgier, short wig. Mm -hmm just short of a pixie, not quite a pixie. And she may look at this and say, oh, that's too, too much. much for mm -hmm. me. But this is perfect because it will give the woman that edgy look without her going too far out of the box. Right. I like, I like the, I like the, the curls and, the and there's way. fullness. Mm -hmm. It's very nicely shaped. It's a very, very nice shape. I think that shape it's looks beautiful. beautiful on I mean, I absolutely like, I love the fact that these have little, you know, the, ed the ends of these of these curls are very sort of like chopped and blunt. But then you've got this really nice soft shape right here to even that out. It's so a little true. bit of both. Oh, I, I love it. I think it looks fantastic. And the back has got, like, everything about this is great. Like, this is a great wig. This is the wig that if you wanted a short hairstyle and went to your stylist and he was a really great stylist, mm -hmm. they would shape your hair perfectly, and this hit the point on on shape. This is unbelievable. And the color, you know what? Even though it's 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 red-ish, yeah. it's not bad. I love the way it looks. And you know what? I, 
Can I go on record as saying, yes. I love the way all of these wigs look. And if you are a wig wearer, that's what you need to do. You need to love the way that you look. Because if you mm -hmm. don't love the way you look, nobody else is going to love the way you look. It shows. So you got to get out there and you got to empower yourself because that's it, what it's about. Oh, I love look it. I'm so fun. happy that you were able to be with us to Oh my God, I styles. wouldn't miss this for the world. I love you guys. I know, we love <laughs> Kathy. This has been so much fun. Thank you so much, Kathy, for joining us Anytime. to showcase these wigs. And we hope that you guys find something that you like. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.